Hello, this is Sudarshan, Assistant Professor in Civil Engineering from Dr. Magalingam College of Engineering and Technology. In this video, we are going to see in short about an open elective course which is termed as Safety Engineering. So first of all, Safety Engineering is a process of designing workplaces to prevent the accidents. In this pandemic situation, everybody wants to be safe. So in order to being safe, uh, we have to engineer or master the concept of safety uh, to be safe in all environment. So engineering safety concepts provides detailed approaches and modes for accident reduction by using a risk management process uh, by means we can eliminate the risk or reduce it to acceptable levels to identify and to design out the hazards. So safety design will ensure not only safety for people but also a safe operational concept that can carry over into capabilities for the facility to handle the industrial and non-industrial incidents and minimize the cause effect. Okay, the syllabus of uh, safety engineering comprises of five units and the first unit deals with the introduction to concepts. By studying this unit, you will be able to know what are the concept of safety, how the evolu evaluation of uh, safety concept has been happened and what are the organizations uh, which are uh, conducting or uh, making the guidelines for the safety factors and uh, what are the techniques that can be followed for safety analysis and uh, what are the surveys that are being conducted for safety measures and uh, how the samplings have been done for safety measures and uh, how to audit and safety measurements. These are the topics you can be able to know about the safety concept in the unit 1. And unit 2 comprises of uh, occupational health and hygiene. Uh, in this unit, you will be able to know what are the physical hazards as well as chemical hazards and uh, how to eliminate them or to minimize them into its acceptable levels. And the third unit involves with the fire engineering and explosion control. In this unit, you will be able to know what is meant by uh, fire safety measure. How will you be able to control the fire using fire safety techniques and the what are the Indian explosive acts and rules which are very important and uh, what are the techniques available for firefighting and uh, the demonstration of uh, making a firefighting is also available in this unit and the uh, unit 4 comprises of uh, uh, important topic which is safety in construction especially to civil engineers so what are the general safety considerations have been uh, taken into account for uh, construction field and uh, how we can analyze the construction jobs for safety, uh, what are the safety factors uh, which have to be followed for uh, construction of uh, dams, bridges, water tanks and uh, other huge structures and uh, what are the critical factors for failure and uh, how will you regularly monitor and inspect the buildings uh, influencing the safety measures. And the unit 5 comprises of uh, how will you handle safely a material, whether it is a construction material or in any field. So what are the general safety considerations have to be taken into account for material handling and uh, uh, what are the role of uh, ropes, chains, sling, hoops, clamps, arresting gears which are uh, already used in uh, cranes which are mobile cranes and tower cranes what are the checklists uh, checklists that have been uh, followed for uh, safety measures and the need for competent persons uh, for uh, handling the safety measures so these are the five units uh, which are uh, available in safety engineering by studying the safety engineering you will be able to know uh, how to uh, handle fire uh, safety techniques and how to handle materials and uh, what are the occupational uh, health and hygiene measures that have to be followed and uh, how can we be safe in construction field or in any other uh, industry and uh, I hope this video will be helpful for you to understand about uh, safety engineering and thank you, thank you very much.